In the heart of London, amid the fog and bustling streets of the 18th century, a story brewed. As the Thames meandered, London riverbanks teemed with life, and porter, the favoured drink of the city stock workers, flowed just as freely. The world of beer witnessed a revelation, an evolution of porter into something darker, something richer. Extra stout porter offered deeper hues, a more pronounced roasted character, and a higher alcohol content. Later abbreviated to just stout, it was a drink for those who wanted a punch, both in terms of alcohol and flavour. London's brewers caught on quickly. In this maze of cobbled streets and brick facades, stout began its ascendance. It wasn't too long before this beer, born out of porter, became a sensation not just in London, but across the entire world. Small beer is rooted in tradition, but brewed for today. Their new stout defies convention. It retains the rich, roasted allure and depth but takes a much gentler approach to alcohol content. The Thames, this iconic lifeblood of London, the city where stout was first brewed, needs our help if it's to stay healthy and vital, if it's still gonna be okay for future generations to enjoy. That's why Small Beer are donating 5% of the sale of every stout to In The Drink, a group that's committed to getting rid of single-use plastics from the river. You can also join the Small Beer team here on Bermondsey Beach on the 21st of October for a big Thames cleanup with free stout for everybody taking part. See you there.